in the case, of Mr. Mollet, in 2007, where the two 14-year-old girls accused yeah. you of rape and getting them drunk. Sexual assault. What happened there? Because you were arrested and held yeah. for a while. What happened is, is uh, two days prior before my arrest, uh, well, I had, prior to that there, I had an order of protection against uh, the one girl's, 13-year-old girl's mom, and I had an order of protection against her as well. And her, I was over there drinking, and so I had some people over in my house drinking and stuff, and her mother called over there wanting to know if she'd come over. And she, my, she caused an argument between me and my wife, caused my wife to go to jail. And uh, she, she said she'd come over and she'd have sex with me if I let her come over. I said, like, yeah. I'm like, oh, darn, what's up? Went to bed. She uh, told me, made out with me, and then I went in the bathroom. I called uh, the police to have her move and said, I got an order of protection. I want this bitch out of my house. And then uh, two days later, uh, her daughter and her daughter's friend came to my house. They left. Then when I was asleep, they crawled in the window and whatever, I don't know, got a bath and stuff in my house and stuff when I was sleeping. And uh, they questioned my mom where they were at. Oh, Richard raped us. And uh, what it is basically toleration that, uh, that I tried to get her mom arrested. Did you no. give them any alcohol that no. night? Why they arrested me? Because they took their word. Because, yes, they were in my house that day, but the thing is, they arrested me right off the bat, but uh, they arrested me. No evidence. They, uh, matter of fact, uh, took my mattress to have it checked for DNA and all this stuff. And uh, How long were you in jail? Uh, I did almost 90 days. And then you got out on bail? Yes. And they dropped the charge about a year and a half later? Uh, I thing like that here. I was brought up, uh, there was uh, 11 of us kids, single mom, single mom, well my father was deceased, died, uh, but I was uh, brought up Kelly and I was brought up on the country and I was brought up with morals and that's where a lot of people these days do not have is morals. They don't have no freaking morals and that's one thing, my mom did not have very much, uh, very high education. But uh, my one thing I'm glad my mom did is give me my morals.